Member for Barron River, Michael Trout, has spoken for the first time about the croc trap set by government-employed contractors in a Cairns Creek a month ago. Wildlife activist Bob Irwin today compared the tactic with illegal poaching. Michael Trout broke his silence about the traps set right under his nose. Yes, they identified some snares, uh, but whether they were set or whether they were used, uh, is we have not clarified that. Bob Irwin says the wire snares found in a Clifton Beach Creek were designed to intentionally inflict severe pain, causing distress and even death for crocodiles. These are the type of situations that we see with poaching in third world countries. Mr Trout says there's no evidence the contraptions in his electorate did harm any animals, but agrees the approach was out of line. We do not condone this type of uh, operation with uh, removing crocodiles from the northern beaches. Bob Irwin says it's time Environment Minister Andrew Powell answered. I'd like a phone call from Andrew to, ex to explain this situation to me. He says clarity and consequences are needed. Is this being done without the knowledge of the Queensland Parks and Wildlife Service or the government, or is this being done with their knowledge? Going forward, we shall make sure that uh, they do best practice and uh, they are removed humanely. Mackenzie Lyon, 7 News. It is your environment, but you're probably going to have to fight for it.